Hey guys, it's John. Welcome to my playthrough of Tim War 5's DLC, The Flood. This is $3 on Steam. Uh, the main game is 8 Let's just go ahead and play it. I can't believe there's DLC for this game. All right. Don't know what we're getting into, but... Oh! The room's flooded. Look at that. So this is the same house, I assume, that's in the the main game. BuddyBot002. BuddyBot will keep you and your family safe 24-7. Nifty. It watches, listens, and lets you know about any possible dangers in your daily life. It can also answer many questions about the upcoming weather to history facts, or just give you its opinion on whatever you want. Rules on how to operate BuddyBot002. Feel free to ask it any questions and it will answer. And then in red it says, NEVER TURN PAINBOT001 ON! <laughs> uh, second rule is it's an intelligent and learning computer, so be polite. In case of the first rule break, always obey PainBot001. Talk to 002. Ask how to get out. It's not powerful enough to become aggressive if you will be polite. Okay. <laughs> it's that simple. Do not make it mad. Do not die. Always obey 001. Okay. So this is confusing. So there's BuddyBot002 and PainBot001. So you, you're not supposed to turn the first one on, but if you do, you've got to obey the first one. Okay. Eh, that's a little confusing. Let's uh, let's do it. it. Says hello. Hello. You may ask a question. Where am I? Your location coordinates are unknown to me. I'm standing literally in front of you. Who are you? My name is Painbot002. What? Artificial intelligence, not human. Pain. Yes. Oh, do you see the little, you see that spooky face? It was all red. What happened to 001? That does not answer my question. Oh no, prison bars. We've been imprisoned. So, uh, so what now? In here? Press E to turn on electricity. I don't think I should be interacting with these circuits while I'm standing in water. But that's just me, you know. Common sense, probably not needed in this game. So now what? So the electricity came off? So now I can talk to, to pain bot again. You may ask a question. Okay, how do I get out? Find the stairs. What was that? Why am I here? To suffer, to suffer, to suffer. Oh, oh, no data. Ah, oh, okay. That must have been just a glitch. Where do I find the stairs? The stairs will appear soon. Troll face, are you okay? Yes. <laughs> oh, no, the only option is kill me. Kill me. Where are those footsteps coming from? Oh, it's the Timor mannequin. Hello, doll. It's all coming flooding back to me. Oh, this door's open now. This is different. So who's this? Get out, now. Okay, I'll, I'll try. I gotta find the stairs first. So, you know, where are they? <laughs> 
Anything back here? Do I have to turn the power back on again? Apparently the power is fine. Get out now? Yeah, that's what I've been trying to do. Ooh, look! Something broke through the bars. The water level isn't rising though, so it's fine. Must be a drain somewhere. The stairs will appear soon. Stairs will appear? Yes, you can't leave at any time. Wait for the mannequin to come back. He will leave the entrance open. I saw the mannequin already. Of course you did. What exactly is the mannequin? He is the eyes for the fear. Why are you helping me? I'm not. I'm just answering your questions. Stairs have appeared. The mannequin is back! Oh no, not the mannequin. It's been a pleasure. Goodbye. But I thought you were pain bot. You're not supposed to experience pleasure, right? Oh look, the mannequins are appearing on all the all the computer monitors. So where are the stairs? Can I interact with this one again? It just says, yes, are you? I guess we're done with that one then. Okay. So stairs have appeared, but um, where exactly? Stairs. I hear walking. Oh, here they are. I found them. Am I back in the main house? I think this might be a different house. It just looks exactly the same. It's uh, incredible to me that in every instance of these cabinets, there's always a white mug on the left side in the middle. And actually, they're arranged in exactly the same way. Somebody was very thorough when they set these up. Here's another exact replica. Here's another one. The thermometer starts beeping if the temperature fastly drops down. You'll know the mannequin is near or something else. Okay, so anything really. So so if the if the temperature drops, that means that there's a presence. Got it. Where's the thermometer? <laughs> oh, news. Good. July 11th. The first 150 people got their first buddy bots. So far, the results are amazing. Buddy bot detects fire risk. Weather conditions. Reminds the user about important things they have to do. Keeps a conversation. It's like a virtual buddy, but even better. These computers might change the world. We already got those. Uh, it's called Google Home or uh, Amazon Echo. They're already out. Not a big deal. June 10th. I had to rename PainBot. Its name will be BuddyBot for kid-friendly purposes. Got a contract to start production and found someone who will help me out with the marketing. So wait. So this is July 11th. They manufactured the BuddyBot in just over a month after the idea's conception. That is a realistic timeline. They laughed at my creation on June 14th. I don't blame them. They are too dumb to understand. July 25th, Buddy Bot 002 prototype production got canceled. Fine, 002 wasn't as powerful as 001 anyway. What? Probably should be the other way around, changing the name back to PainBot. Why? Who would buy something called PainBot? Your business deserves to fail. Take that thing on Shark Tank or Dragon's Den and see what happens. Get laughed out of the room. How much is your business worth? Uh, hello. <laughs> I want to get out. Where do I go? Okay, well, I was expecting something to be there, but there was nothing there. They're clearly 
the mannequins, right? <laughs> Why are they covered up? Someone's gonna take these off, though. Hey, I turned around and it was different. This isn't how it was when I first came in. Oh, I'm covering up the thermometer. Sorry, guys. I didn't realize that it would be... It's in the lower right corner. Oh, it's red. I can't get out, so this is... Double O one is waiting. Obey. Oh, was I supposed to go towards obey? July 15th, yesterday 23 people went missing. Kids and adults from all over the country. The only common thing about these families is that all of them have the new buddy bots. We have no information on how that happened, but maybe the people who made buddy bot will give us some answers. The rest of the users are throwing away their buddy bots. Room accessible. False. Let's change it. What? What happened? What? What did I click on? Ah! What did I? Did I take the computer and the desk with me? What am I lugging it around right now? I missed the prompt. I know you guys can't see the thermometer, I'm sorry. Here, oh, I should've just moved out of the way in the first place, you know, you can see it. Okay, um. I think there's something at the end of this. Do you see it? Do you see it back there? <gasps> it says off. Let's turn it on. Press E. Wow. <laughs> what, what, what did we do? Nothing moved. The text that is on the machine just changed. Now it's on. Okay, now what? Do we walk back? Machine turn on. Someone set up us the bomb. Oh, it's main screen turn on, isn't it? Not machine turn on. Wow, I got that meme wrong. Got it all wrong. So am I supposed to be walking back this way? The thermometer. Uh-oh. I don't get the thermometer thing. So what, a, a mannequin's around? A long ass hallway. What? Oh, it just disappeared earlier. Okay. That's what happened. Do you see it? <gasps> Come back. Oh, you're so funny. Come back, please. <gasps> There's nothing there. <laughs> It was that dreadlocked thing from Timor 5. I forget what the character's name is, or... I think it's like the mom and the family or something. Wasn't there like a family in Timor 5? I completely forget everything about that game, to be honest. Except that everything has like this texture on it. Every single thing in the game has like... Glossy wall paint texture. What, are we turning this on again? I did it. I heard something, but I don't... Okay. Don't waste my time. Uh, I assume we're just supposed to keep going this way.
back up the stairs. Wait, what? Room accessible, false. What? Okay, room accessible, true. What? I'm... Oh, did you see him? Where'd you go? You look like you need to be juggling something. You freaking clown. Where are you? Oh. So, okay. So, what we gotta do... What we gotta do is just turn on all the machines. She stood up. Uh-oh. There's another doll. False. How many of these are there? Holy crap. So I gotta get four. Okay, I gotta get four machines turned on. So this one I haven't done yet, right? Or have I? Have I done this one yet? Okay, I'm just gonna keep going until I find a machine. You know what, I'm just gonna move back into a comfortable position because the temperature thing doesn't seem to pop up that often. Look at that backbone, dude. Your back is like concave. You need to do some workouts. Look at that booty. Doesn't really have one. I'm not body shaming him. But I guess I am. Hmm. Sorry about that. I think there's a line, and I just crossed it. I'm sorry, friend. There's nothing wrong with you. Where are you? <laughs> Come on, guys. Did you think that was going to get me? Come on. Come on. Oh, he was he was among the ones with the uh, cloak on them. He was hiding out. Hi. Um. Oh, hey, I need to go this way actually. Where'd you go? Okay, I guess I need to turn on one more machine. I did this one, didn't I? Oh wait, no, I did. Did I do this one? Okay. <laughs> this is basically Timor Six. It's just not called that. Yeah, what are you gonna do? Kill me? Oh boy. Let's go ahead and turn this one on. What a complicated system. Why would you have a computer hooked up to like four different generators hidden in alternate dimensions? Oh. <laughs> I feel like those sound effects should be even more exaggerated. They should be like the Inception sound effect. They should just be as dramatic as possible. Oh, this one's red. He's the scariest one. Hi. Ha ha ha. Figured out your tactics. Okay. I've got all four of them on. So... Come on, I've turned on all the machines, I thought. If you stare into the dark darkness long enough, I almost said darkness. If you stare into the darkness long enough, you can see his face. 
I mean, if you look into the darkness long enough, you can see anything that you want to see. I see there's a light down there. These mannequin mascots are just kind of irrelevant at this point. Oh boy, let's just turn this on. Why'd you put this in the back of the room? Uh-oh. I guess I've been staring at the darkness long enough. Did you hear that drip? There was some water. Where is he? He's too fast. I can't keep up with him. Up. Oh. Can we go back now? <laughs> Tee! <laughs> that was funny. Oh, it's on now. Painbot! Hello. Hello, I am Painbot001. How can I help you? I wasn't supposed to turn it on, but now we are. Uh, why are you cold like that? Let's just say I want to get out. Don't let the fear see you. Okay, that's, that's not helpful. Why are you called like that? I was named after my creator's inspiration, Pain. Who is your creator? What, I am? Oh, his name is Frank. What are the creatures haunting this place? The mannequin lives here. Everything else is what the fear sends to you. Time is up! Time is up on what? What? Okay. Oh, judgment day is here. <gasps> Look at it. It's so big. <laughs> That's what she said. Oh, hey guys. You may leave a message. Okay. I can't get out. Walking endlessly. Losing hope to wake up from this nightmare. Whoever finds this message, please help me. I'm still here. Sarah. Oh no. There are other victims? Do I go this way? I'm, I'm guessing because the other two guys... We're over there and they were like, not gonna let me through, I don't think. Hey, it's that same sound effect that we heard earlier. Now we're hearing it again. He's just unwrapping some cheese crackers, okay? Let him be. Ah, they've got evil faces on them. Evil doll faces. Okay. Hi. I just want to use this computer. Kill the guard? Press E. Okay. So, what? Kill the guard? What did pressing E on the computer kill the guard? Is that what I was saying just now? Hmm. Okay. Um, I'm guessing I walked back, but I... I don't really understand. Oh, kill the... Oh, these guys that were on the side. But there were two of them. Oh, okay. I'm gonna just walk past this one. Oh. Is there another one? Another computer I have to... Okay. There's another computer that'll say kill the guard. I'll press E and then that guy will be gone too. <laughs> they did the same thing twice! <laughs> oh boy. I will never understand why you can't sprint into more games. Yeah, let's kill him. Bye. <sighs> Excuse me, I've got uh, some place to be. Can you imagine remotely killing people by pressing E on a computer? Uh oh, the temperature is rising or dropping, I guess. It doesn't really seem to indicate anything. 
Because apparently, according to the game, it just means that anyone is around. Oh, here we go. What's up, pain bot? No. What do you mean, no? Well, we can't hang out? Stay. Do not leave. You're sending all kind of mixed messages. Fine. Go. Okay. Oh. Hey, you want to play chess? I don't like this. It's automated. You disobeyed. Okay. Well, it looks like I'm winning, actually. Am I blue? Dude, these are terrible moves. Checkmate! Oh, no! <laughs> He's my favorite one. Thanks for playing. Sure, I guess. Is it over? Oh. Gotta have him in the background one more time, being like... Uh, okay, so that was basically just like what Timor 6 would have been. It was like rehashed Timor 5. Even like the ending sequence was exactly the same as the base game. It was about like what, 25 minutes long? Oh. So, I wanna give it credit in some regard, in some places. Cause I, I I thought it was a little interesting at first when you go to the computer and I thought you were making like choices But then I realized that you were just kind of like running through all the different options until it bottlenecked you and moved you on to the next sequence, so I mean at least it's a little different than the other Tim Wars. But at the same time, it's exactly the same, so uh, just keep in mind, in order to play this DLC, you have to pay like 11 bucks. Eight for the base game, which is outrageous, and three for the DLC, so. Yeah. Well, that was Timor 5 The Flood. And actually, before we exit, no, I didn't want to play. Damn it. I gotta show you guys something. I gotta show you guys something, because the original Timor 5 has been altered. Okay, hang on. There's a new mode in Timor 5. I discovered this because I was trying to launch the DLC and I launched the main game because the launcher that comes up is ambiguous. Look in the lower left corner. You can press H for Halloween mode. You guys ready for this? You ready to see Halloween mode? Ah! That's Halloween mode. Halloween mode? Non-Halloween mode. Halloween mode? Non-Halloween mode. Couple pumpkins and a skeleton. Spooky, scary, extra spooks. <laughs> so anyway, I just wanted to share that. Oh, man. Hey, okay, so yeah, that was Timor 5 The Flood. I don't know why it wasn't just Timor 6. Whatever. Anyway, let me know what you guys thought in the comments. And I will see you guys in the next video. Think critically.